3120 XP Escobar. I'm showing some parts on it. First of all, here's the car bed. Your chokes here. On off. There was a something that regulated how much oil goes to the chain there. That was on, turned on all the way and snapped off. The oil locks here. This is not well, doesn't work. Now this one came with the full wrap. This one is made in 1989. And it's all stock, all original, nothing done to it. This is this sticker here. It says 1989, 1989. But damn phone's not fucking. The dog is hurt my dogs. The little problem I'm having with this one is the studs here like to go in and out. It kind of pisses me off. Because every time I put the bar on, it goes off. And they're a little. Oh, this fucking camera. They're a little stripped. Uh, this scratches up in there. It does have an idling problem. It gets too hot to the point it doesn't like to idle anymore, but it does run a cut. That fell, that bridge and one that fell out, had to replace it, and that was stuck a nail in there. Had to replace both these. Put a new gasket in there. Now, this saw sat in a barn for two years. I took it home. Put some oil in the cylinder, turn it over, and broke it loose. It'll fire right up. Uh, they did change, I noticed, I think they changed the air filter a little bit. Here's my air filter. Yes, it's the original. It's a little old and dirty. I cleaned the carb up after probably after how this twenty some odd years. I've taken this whole thing apart, redone it. Compression valve barely works. Maybe that's a good saw. I've read well, what people said this one has 125 cc's instead of 119. I know they drop one down a cc every year. Uh, New one's a 3120 XP, this one's a 3120 W. I can't freaking zoom in, my phone's being a piece of shit. Mine's a 3120 XP W. And it has absolutely no compression. It's just to be able to pick the thing up. None. No, it still cuts and refuses to die. Nope. There it is.